The timeline gadget allows an author to create and annotate a series of events. Learners can study the timeline by clicking on event labels and reviewing additional information that is specific to each event. Zoom in and out of the timeline by clicking on the plus and minus icons, or use the scroll wheel on your mouse. To navigate forward or backward, click anywhere on the timeline and drag the mouse right or left. To view additional information about an event, select the events label on the timeline. You can also click the left and right navigation arrows to view the content of the previous or subsequent event. To use the timeline gadget in your course, drag the gadget into the player. A property sheet appears which will allow you to specify the start and end date of your timeline. You can also choose to have time included in the dates of your events. Click on the gear icon at any time to modify these settings. A sample event is already in place for you to start editing. Start typing into the sample event card. At the top right corner of the gadget is the date of the event. Move the event label to the correct point on the timeline by changing the date in the event card or clicking and dragging the label to its proper place in time. To the left of the date is a field for the event's title, which will also be seen below on the timeline as the event label. Below the event title is a text field for you to add details about that particular event. You can add additional detail by adding an image to your event. Click on the image box on the left where it says, No image chosen, to upload an image. To delete an event you've created, click on the event label in the timeline and click on the red X to the right of the label. To add another event to your timeline, double-click on the part of the timeline where you would like to add an event. You can always change its placement by clicking and dragging the event in the timeline or by typing a new date into the date field of the event card. That's it! The Timeline Gadget is an efficient tool that you can use to convey event-based or historically structured content, adding an extra layer of depth to your course.